Dot Airways Flight DA001 is ready for takeoff. Bound for Matty. Clear the runways of obstruction, please. Dot Airways Ghani. Runway 1 cleared for takeoff. Flight time will be 20 minutes and 30 seconds. Unbelievably, this is my 50th vlog, and I'd like to thank you all for supporting me these last 10 months. And vlog 50 marks the start of something new. And no more cheesy intros, don't worry. Davo Oriental, a land where the thick mountain spine meets the ocean. The Davo Surigao Coast Road hugging the mountainside, proving a struggle to widen to provide enough capacity for motorists. I just want to appreciate whoever did that. That's artistic. But the first two municipalities in Oriental South, Banai Banai and Lupon, are different. Huge flat plains of rice, with the mountains just a distant sight. And I love seeing the patterns from the air. Just 200 metres from the highway, there's a place that I remember well. Norberto's is a family-owned place that grows all the pantat that it sells in ponds beside the restaurant. Life is just a one giant food trip. And yes, I am watching my weight. It's going up. Life's too short to not eat good food, but I'm gonna, hmm, what am I gonna do? I don't know. I'm here at Norberto's Resto Bar, which I came to in one of my very, very early vlogs. And hopefully this vlog's a tiny little bit better than that one. Um, yeah, all this food in front of me. Awesome. Right, I am going to try first this chicken. What's going on with me? I never eat fried chicken. Now it's a once a week thing. This is really tender. What? What's in the batter? Oh my God. I'm not a chef though. <laughs> but, no, it is what it is. I like to eat that one. I think Dad, I love the vlog. Hello again, by the way, Bill. I just put you straight on the spot as your first, for the first thing ever. Yeah. That was, yeah, yeah, yeah. I surround myself with other Dalot people. That's <laughs> the way to do life. <laughs> Oh god. Unknown ingredients, very good. Sweet chili sauce, also very good. Mixed. Not mixed. That's what happens when you do things for the camera. You don't do things properly. <laughs> Fantastic. This is Hito, which has come... Fantastico. Pantat. Hito. Fantastico. Depending on what language you speak. Fantastico. Fantastico. Fantat. Okay. Fantastico. Fantastic. Bill is very good at puns. Fantastic, say that again with Pan the song. Fantastic, fantastic. What did you say again? Fantastic. Fantastic. No, no, fantastic. Fantastic. 
Fantastico. That works yeah. much better because you have sunglasses on. The head. I thought I could see teeth. I can't. You did really bite the head. Why did I do that? I, I don't eat pantat head. Yeah. Why did you eat that one? You can't eat the pantat head. <laughs> what did I witness? I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I should just eat my food That's and that. stop trying to vlog it. That would be the best, wouldn't it? That's for that. everyone. Food time, not for the camera. You've seen me taste it. That's enough. Bill started farming Bangos about the same time as me and his ponds are across the rice fields towards the ocean. And I wanted to ask how things have been going recently. What happened here? Oh, can I get a bit of 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 a a bit of a bit of a bit of a bit of Nah, it's about like when's uh, December, put no? December, this, ah no, November I think. Ah November, pa. Happy, happy lang sa ako, ah. Happy lang. <laughs> he had the same problem as me. His, yeah. there was a big hole in the dike and the bangles got, got out around the same time. He had a big hole. My dike's just flooded. This one was okay. So yeah, oh here we are. I mean, I mean, imagine the water was above the level of the dike. Nang lang lang pasan dike. Yeah. Aiki. So, a nice extra like 1.5 meters on top of this. Oh, hello, native fish. So, we're gonna recreate my third, fourth vlog, no, my fourth vlog, I think it was. And we did an interview in Bisaya, except this time I know how to use a camera. So, go on. Bila Bila nakabulan ni? Bila nakabulan? Oh. I think two weeks, three weeks old here. Ah, three weeks long, David. I see him on the ground. Nah, bangos. Here, this pond. Ah, David, put. Only three weeks long. Three weeks long. Ah, three, three, three weeks. Oh God, tap us. Pile like a bull and mag harvest. Ah, uh, usahay magbot sa four months depending sa feeding ratio. So three to four months more on these. They're just they're just new new stock. These, these are actually, they came from the same supplier as, as I got the time where they came on the truck and we ran out of oxygen. Oh, yeah. um, so, so actually the, the stock is very, very good. Uh, it's just, it's Jenny. just that they're here. Shout out to Jenny, who is somewhere down that way. It's yeah. just that, it's just that coming from here to there is, is a couple of kilometers. Going to Katil was hundreds. So big difference, big difference in that. That's. The difficulty here, because as you can see from the from on top, you can see there's a lot of fish ponds here. Shout out to Sir Oka Mendoza, who supply us a juveniles. Thank you. <laughs> good quality, huh? <laughs> These are good, eh? Shout out to the people who keep the country moving and keep the keep the food industry moving. Yeah. Always shout out to those guys, <clears throat> Mr. Mendoza, <laughs> artista. <laughs> is this bridge okay for me? Yeah, yeah, it is. Look at this one. Mm. 
we need to, we need to repair them. This industry is full of maintenance, right? And what you can see here, so a lot of the ponds dried, but what you can see which, well, it is, it's algae. It's algae, natural food for the fish. So we're producing that here. And then, yeah. And I've forgotten everything about boundless because I haven't grown it for months. <laughs> I almost forgot to ask. So what happened to your fish when, when the floods came? Hapit na horot. Like 10% ang nabilin. 90% ang nawala. Same, same, same as uh, my experience during that flood after Tropical Depression, Vicky. I had, out of 12,000, harvested 2,000. Oh, yeah. So, I, it's, oh, it's painful. I mean, I, I, I managed, I managed almost 20%, but, oh, they... It's the most heartbreaking moment to me. Hmm. Yeah, losing 90% uh, of what I have been invested, though. Al al almost harvest, no? Almost harvest. Yeah, I, I, it took me uh, four, mo uh, four months to wait and then one week, I have one week to harvest all of the fish and then the bull won't happen. Nature is a word I can't use on YouTube. <laughs> Not good. And Auntie, who's the star of the show, has a message for Kulas. Magbalik ka dere, nagingon ako mga kapit bahay na magpunta ka doon sa kanila kay makakita sa YouTube para sikat po doon sila. Kaya ako daw na sikat na ako kadali sa YouTube. Astang mga ero sikat. Nya mga chicks pa dung chicks. Mga guys. Ah, daot uyam ni ang asawa ni Kulas. Taka din din. Sorry to me. Sorry to me. We sorry. This is a real life YouTube fame story. A YouTube hasikat story. A real life. I like Banai Banai. I always have a good time here. The first time I ever came here. I drank too much tuba, and I think that's where I started to like Banai Banai. And now I come here and look at fish and eat food, which is also good. It was time to go back to Matty, but then we encountered this. That trike is, that is a fake tricycle with a Toyota logo on it. The Hilux Lickle. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on in Banai Banai? It's conspiracies everywhere. The coast road continues to Mati along an incredibly scenic route beside Buhada Bay. Come to Amihan Sadahikan, where they're trying to protect sea turtles from the threats of poaching and habitat destruction. This is Winston, who is going to show and explain more to us. These turtles have just hatched, but are not yet active enough to be released, so they'll be returned to the sand for now. but they'll be released in the morning. 
ginano na ako sila gi, gina, ano na lang, ginabutangan ng buhangin kaya after pila ka hours ani or oras mag move na ni sila karon ginalis lang sila gatong buhangin na healthy dili baho para maka move yun sila mm, hey ma'am, surf mo surf Each of these holes has about 50 baby turtles hatch from 70 to 80 eggs. Ang ginabuhat namo diri ah uh, ini mga laga sa kalikasan o napon mi mga bata na ginatudloan namo about unsa ang life sa kinabuhi o kinabuhi pud sa dagat, kinabuhi sa atong lugar, sa mga pawikan pag pagprotekta sa kinaiyahan. I know that you can protect the Pawikan, but you can't do it in nature. In Mangood, you need to protect the first thing that you need to protect. The first thing that you need to protect is the Pawikan. If you don't have the Pawikan, it's the beauty of the Pawikan. Or the beauty of the Pawikan. It's the beauty of the Pawikan. The Pawikan is the beauty of the Pawikan. It's the beauty of the Pawikan. It's the beauty of the Pawikan. It's the beauty of the Pawikan. If you can see the Pawikan, Kurang tak naga limpio satu farm sila pun naga limpio selalum sedagat, para maguapuang oksigen, maguapuang mangdagan ang produjo sa isda. Kung kung kuna kaya sa kasamana, pila ka buak pawikan magwalis sedagat? Ah, karon na week almost seven hundred hatchling ang nabalik na sedagat. Oh, kay every 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 day na atay naga hatch. Oh, po sa isa ka tuig. Karon sa among pagprotekta ni abot na og so 55 ka mama ang nagiitlog 55 ka buok mama Oh nagiitlog It's oh, stakang kayo no oh. Sa mga ubang lugar ubang barangay o ubang munisipyo naa gyud pay pawikan dito nagapangitlog Diri lang mo nang kami ang nagprotekta dire kay una crowded namong gud gyud sa turista O oh, labi na magabi bisag asa lang magitlog ang pawikan pus dagan mga hubog gunitan mag gunitan ang pawikan o oh, na madamid sang ilang habitat pod o oh, pos mga basura ibilin lang sa baybay mo na po ni isa nakaguba sa atong dagat na moy community dewi unsay pila pila ka buwak mo o unsay toyo sa community dewi uh, ang among community ang um, uh, dagan kami mga bata na may mga 35 ka buwak mga bata ang trabaho lang nila magbantay sa conservation mga laga sa pawikan, maglimpyo sa baybay, mga monitog plastic. Ang pinaka-importante, muskwila sila, umudula. Mawala ang ilang buhaton. Five o'clock in the morning, time to release. One hundred turtles released. journeying towards the ocean. Some go ahead. while others struggle behind. Then the first get taken to their new home on the wave from sheep. Others just get a taster. Tourists shouldn't get too close in case a poor baby turtle gets caught in a slipper hole. Sunrise is the perfect time to release on this east facing beach. The turtles go towards the light. Those four are afraid to go in, so 
we've got a hundred of them and the survival actually out in the wild is about 1% so of all of these only one's going to survive probably you can already see them being eaten by the fish out there in the ocean so that's why preserving the ones that are left and actually supporting their breeding and hatching process is so important 